What's up, everybody? Surf and Silver here, and I am back with some of my favorite quarters from this past week, and I would like to share them with you guys. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's check these coins out. I, s I have the ones here. These are my favorites, and these ones are all right. They're really nice, but these ones are my favorites. Check this 78 out. Absolutely gorgeous coin. The back shining perfectly. Look at that thing. For being from 1978, I mean, that's a heck of a nice coin, quite honestly. Here we have a 1965 shining bright like a diamond. Almost its complete original luster. The back, absolutely gorgeous. Look at those fields as the light passes over it. Beautiful coins, beautiful. And they make me happy. It makes me happy just finding these nice coins and being able to share them with you guys. Check this 2020 out. 2020. American Samoa National Park, one of my favorites and a crowd favorite as well. Beautiful. This was my favorite out of the entire batch, a 1980. We'll get close up on this one. It's missing the I on In God We Trust and the T, I think. Yeah, it's almost got the T. Barely got the N. B A. Super clean. Look at the back. Absolutely gorgeous coin. I'm very proud of coins like this. These are the coins that I want to save. And these are the coins that I want in my collection. Because they're still readily available, and they're, and they're yet they're uh, they're currently worth more than their face value, in my opinion. And in in it and in pre and in future years, they will be worth more than their face value, much more. If you have rolls of these in the future, you're definitely doing a lot better than you thought you would be. Check out this one. This is the cleanest Kanaka Ole that I think I might have. It needs to be in a capsule immediately. This thing has like no marks on it at all. It is beautiful. I don't know how it stayed this clean while it got to me. Man, absolutely gorgeous. Here we, uh, on this channel, we really like to uh, appreciate all coins. All coins can be appreciated here. We have a Tuskegee Airman. I really love this coin, and so do other people. But yeah, really wanted to share these coins with you guys. We could always do, we could always do uh, one of the, you know, nice quarters in the years, or just as the months go on, you know, I'll upload, you know, however, however many weeks I can get them out, I will, but. I really enjoy showing you guys my recent finds from the grocery stores. These are coins from grocery stores and from getting food and stuff. And it just shows that you can get beautiful coins and you are getting beautiful coins like this. And uh, yeah, as soon as you get them and you see that they're brand new, what I do is I just basically, you know, I put them in my pocket because my fingerprints will do more damage. And uh, whenever I get to the car, I carefully bring them out and I put them in the safe place that I have in my car for them. And then next thing I know, I'm here making a video about them. I really enjoy beautiful quarters. And uh, it doesn't always have to have silver in it for me to really like it. I like the readily availableness of quarters. <clears throat> you can get them any day. But yeah, I really hope everybody has a great rest of their day. 
I'm looking into buying some silver here soon, so we're getting to see some new rounds. Right now, uh, the man has a hundred ounce Inglehard bars, and uh, the premium on, on that would be probably too much for me right now, so I'm not able to get it. You know, there's just some things that you're just not going to be able to get. If you're still watching this. You are a true fan, and you definitely enjoy my videos, and I really appreciate you. And, uh, yeah, if you aren't able to make a purchase, there's always, there's always, and I mean always, another day to buy some silver. I hope everybody has a great rest of their day, yo. Peace out.